We next discuss three key control structures in Python. If, while, and for. In addition, we introduce control statements continue, break, and pass. The if statement is a pillar of programming. In conjunction with logical operators, it tests conditions. In our example, we first test if variable x is less than zero. If it is, the code prints negative, and terminates. Elif is used to carry out secondary tests in case the initial test fails. In our case, if the first test fails, Elif tests if x is equal to zero. If it is, it prints zero. The body of the final else executes if all previous tests have failed. Note that there may be multiple Elif statements. The while statement is used to iterate. The statement keeps executing while the logical condition is met. In our example the logical condition is a less than 5. Since a is initially 0, the statement executes 5 times and prints numbers from 1 to 5. Note the condition within the print statement. When a is less than 5, a space is appended at the end of the string. Otherwise a new line is appended. Statement for is often used to iterate over ranges, sets, and lists. The continue statement is used to proceed to the next iteration by ignoring remaining statements in the body of the loop. The break statement terminates a loop. The pass statement is used to denote a function or a loop that do nothing. In our example, the argument of the function is preceded by an asterisk, which denotes a non-predefined number of arguments. As we will see, this construct comes handy in test-driven development.